Hi, welcome back to this pet. Today we're with Ken and Tika, and we're going to see if Tika can be your perfect pet. Welcome back to this pet. So what can you tell us about Tika? Tika's a little over one, one year old female. Um, she's been here for a couple of weeks now. She is very human friendly. She's got some good energy. She needs to be the only dog in the home unless somebody has some special dog training because uh, she does react to other dogs. She loves her treats and she just has a little, she has a nice little idiosyncrasy that when we had uh, storms the last week, she hid under her bed and not under when it was standing up on its four legs. It was upside down and she was under the bed. So she really likes that. So she's just, um, just she needs a, probably a special owner, but she just, she's great with people. Um, she likes to give face kisses, but you gotta be really careful with it because she gets jumpy and real excited about it. Um, and she does listen, listen real well. Does Tika know any commands? Um, she does the basic sit stay. She, she's very good with uh, general commands, like I ask her to come over, she'll come over. When we're ready to go, I walk up to the gate, she'll come over to the gate to me. So, but she hasn't been specifically trained with a lot of items, but she does, basically she listens well. Uh, and she's pretty responsive to those things. Even when she gets a little rambunctious, clap your hand, tell her to come over, and she'll usually come over. The, um, the issue here is that, as you can see, she's a lot, she's very calm here. If we were outside, she'd be patrolling around, looking for other dogs, people, listening to the dogs inside there and jumping up, looking, just, you know, being very curious. At home, she's gonna have a structured environment. And as I said, as you can see here, she's a lot more, a lot calmer. There's a dog outside the uh, door right there and she's not paying attention to him at all. Is Tika house trained? Yes, she, she's, very, she's very good about coming out and peeing and pooping right away once she get out, which is a strong indication that she's house trained. What family uh, do you think Tika would be best in? She'd be, she'd be best with a family that doesn't have any other pets, um, with somebody that, that is uh, familiar with dogs that wants to put some time into working with her and, and um, you know, just, they, they, basically they have to be the in-charge alpha animal or pack leader with her. Um, Again, set all sorts of a structured environment. Dogs are always great in a structured environment and make sure she has certain rules that she abides to and be very consistent with that. Is there anything else we should know about this dog? No, she's just a lot. The, the thing that we encourage here is She's a pretty dog. You want to come in and interact with the dog. That's actually required, but to spend some time with the dog and see what she is because you're going to react differently to each dog. Each dog is going to react differently to you. Um, see how they warmed up and just see how you get along. It's real important to uh, get to know that dog. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You can find more information about Tika at ocnetpets.com. You can find more information about us at PickThisPet.com or our Facebook page, PickThisPet. If you are watching us on YouTube, please subscribe and comment. And uh, find us on Facebook at PickThisPet. And uh, like our page. Thank you so much for watching, and we hope you find your perfect pet.